Hello my friends and welcome to another Tuesday of Tutorial. I am Leonardo Perez Nieto and today we will draw a gorilla. In this drawing I will test these pencils that I just bought. They are carbon pencils made out of compressed powder which is a mixture of carbon and graphite. They are much darker than graphite, but they don't smear like charcoal does. Okay, let's begin by marking the line of the back and then of the head, the top of the head, like so, almost at a right angle. The top of the head is fairly flat, and here is the brow bone, which is very pronounced in these animals. Then we have the nose that comes down here, and then the lips. The lower jaw sticks out more than the upper one. Let's draw an arm. This will be the forearm, and he will be resting the head, or the jaw, on his wrist. To hold the pencil for this drawing, I have mainly been using the backhand grip and the brush grip, and I'm trying to do the strokes all the way from my shoulder especially for the long lines, of course. And for the sketch, I chose to use the 2B pencil, which is the hardest of the ones in the box. I lowered the line of the back, as you saw, because it was way too long otherwise. And now let's start shading. And for the shading, I switched to a softer lead, which is a 4B. Before I used any of these pencils, of course, I sharpened them properly for drawing, which is with a blade and making the lead much longer. Much longer than what it comes from a regular hand or automatic sharpener. If you want me to show you how to sharpen a pencil for drawing, please let me know in the comments and I'll make a tutorial on that. Or maybe everybody knows that already, so it is not needed. Let's work on the shoulder, the arm, and the hand a little bit. Although I don't want to put a lot of work on this because I want it to be just a sketchy so that the attention of the viewer goes to the face and the head of the gorilla. For the really blacks, I'm using an 8B, which is the softer of all. When you use graphite pencils and you try to get a really black and so you press on them, the black is not really black, but additionally, when you apply pressure on it, it becomes shiny, causing unwanted reflections. So an alternative for the blacks is to use this type of pencil or charcoal, and you can combine them, of course, with graphite. As you see, I like them very much. And I am afraid this is sounding like an ad for the pencils. <laughs> it is not. Nobody paid me or told me to do this. I'm just enjoying them very, very much. They feel better than what I thought they would be. Gorillas are considered highly intelligent. A few individuals in captivity have been taught a sign language. Gorillas can laugh, grieve, have rich emotional lives, develop strong family bonds, make and use tools, and think about the past and the future. Unfortunately, they are critically endangered due to habitat destruction and hunting. We should take care of them because they are definitely fantastic creatures. They are so full of personality. We give it the last touches and it's ready. If you enjoyed it, please give it a like, share it to your friends, and subscribe to Fine Art Tips. I want to wish you a fantastic new year, and I will see you on Tuesday.